show today. What exactly kind of flipped the switch for you in the second half? Mm, the second half, because uh, they start off a little bit pushing, do whatever, like run with a lot of pressures. Like that was good. I know they was not going to keep up for the whole game. Second half, I just say, we got to run. We got to run. If we're not running, then you can't stop me. So that, I think second half, I start with a lot of running. And uh, that's what make it game a little bit easy for them. They big men, they had to keep up and running. If like, I don't know, because um, I think I run a lot. That's why I changed my game. Jerry? Yeah, Oscar, the, the TV guys that called the game talked about you visiting your family in the Congo, and they made it sound like this was recently. Uh, what 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 were they referring to? Um, I don't know. I went back home after six years. Then I went back home this past May. Uh, that was the only chance I get to see my family after six years. I don't know uh, what they were saying. No, they were saying it was a good thing. And, and you kind of got inspiration from it. A Absolutely. Visit. Yeah, what, what, how so? I went home because I went through a lot since I came to America, my transition from place to place, place to place. Obviously, I got some host family. They, it is a family, but sometimes you need support from your own blind, like mom and dad, family, your brothers. Sometimes you're just sitting down, it's like, so I went home. My mom, she said, let's forget about basketball. Let's forget about school right now. Right now, clear your mind. I feel like you're free right now from everything you went through. So I think they really helped me a lot. I was having fun with my family, my brothers and sister, my mom. I forget about everything I went through. And I just came back with different mind my, my mind everything was clear from all these things i went through Thanks. kyle tucker yeah oscar you just said you said uh, you kind of answered my question but you said you just, basically you started running those guys to death in the second half that's that's how you were able to do what you're able to do they just wore down and couldn't keep up with you yes absolutely first off everybody got a energy Everybody got a head and G, they turn it up. That's when, that's when I just run. I started first half at the beginning with a lot of running too, but they had a lot of energy. By the second half, it was, I promised myself, I said to her, like, I'm going to run. They big men, they kind of good, but I don't think they can run it good like me. So I just run, 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 run. They make a game change. When I run, I open up for my teammates because somebody's gonna come in to stop me from now scoring. Then somebody else is open, Kellen, Dave Yondi, and open on the wing, make it three, it's me trying to rebound. I think I finished with like two, three rebound in the first half. Uh, the second half, nobody else was going to the rim. That was a chance for me to grab everything. Uh, and, and as a follow-up to that, did, did you feel did you feel any pressure tonight to start the game? I mean, today was a big day for you. Your National Player of the Year campaign begins. Uh, the the video comes out. Does that add any pressure when 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 the game starts to to like live up to that that billing? Mm, did not have I did not have no pressure on me. I was free like always. I know um, everything is in God's hands. If God is saying you're going to get it, you're going to get it. I cannot put a pressure on myself. That's how I'm going to lose things. Uh, you just got to go out there and do what you do and trust God. If you deserve, nobody else is going to take that from God's sins. God is going to hand it to you no matter what. Okay, last question, Tyler Thompson. Yeah, Oscar, so Kentucky put out that video of you watching your own National Player of the Year campaign. And in it, you said that you couldn't wait to send it to your mother. Yeah. I was wondering what your mom's reaction was, was to it. My mom, she was really happy. Uh, she called me. She was like, I don't know what to tell you. I'm just on my knees, pray for you, for everything you accomplish, and to stay so focused, positive, and share the word of God with these people. I'm not even proud of you about everything you accomplish. I'm just proud of you about what you are doing for God. Be uh, keep doing the same thing. 
and the God is going to show you who he is when you just be faithful to him. That's, I'm, I'm proud of me and everything I'm accomplishing in my life. Um, that's why I keep pushing me, keep doing better, better, better. Nothing easy in this life. Okay, Oscar, thank you for your time. We appreciate it. Yes, sir. Thanks, I'll wrap us up.